This is CMDR coming at you with a video. This one is about my Samsung Galaxy S3. If you've been keeping up with my channel, you'd know that my Nexus 4 was cracked a while back, and this is my replacement phone. This is the AT&T version, and this ROM works for both the AT&T and T-Mobile variants of this device. Um, that is the T999 and the i747. Uh, so this is a 4.4 ROM. It's based on Science Mod 11. It's been compiled by Gon XDA. I'll have the link in the description below, and you also need to use Paranormal Activity or not Paranormal Activity, Paranoid Android uh, G apps uh, for this ROM to work. So here it is, it's pretty smooth, everything's working except for uh, the front facing camera and uh, a couple other things uh, relating to the keyboard. But basically the ROM is very stable, um, as you can tell everything's running fast. I'd say this is running at a full 60 frames a second. It's a lot faster than the 4.3 was on the SGS3 and this is just an alpha build too. So this isn't, you know, this is a lot faster. Obviously, the new um, Project Svelte is working, and so let's just hop into this. Um, obviously, there's there's no home button. Uh, there's no virtual on-screen buttons uh, on this device because it comes with the hard buttons, so you won't see that. But you can see it up in the notification bar. It's actually transparent until you act on it, and then it turns black. So as you can see here, it turns translucent, which is a nice touch in the new uh, UI. Uh, they got rid of hollow, so everything is white themed now, and everything in 4.3 is basically still there. Uh, so let's just hop into settings here so we can confirm this is 4.3 in fact. Or 4.4, right here, 4.4, and here's the uh, little thing. So there it is, that works, everything. And as you can see, this uh, the device number, it says i747, uh, but this ROM also works for the T999, which is the T-Mobile version. This comes with all the signage and mod. Um, features that were ported to it, uh, the ones that work at least. Uh, so the regular launcher, this isn't trebuchet, this is the uh, launcher that comes with 4.4. Everything is smooth, like I've said. Um, also, you have the new uh, launcher for the Google search. OK, Google, and it pops up, and you can just look up stuff like that, which is pretty cool. And if you, um, if you actually enable it, where's that? You can actually have the Google Now thing to the side. So let's see if that's in settings real quick. And this is the new widget uh, choosing thing. So they kind of brought back the old honeycomb uh, version, where now it's not it's no longer in the apps uh, the app section. The app section now is strictly for apps. There are no widgets. Um, so now it's right here, you touch and hold and you get this panel thing, and this is just like in Honeycomb, and you have wallpapers, widgets, and settings. Settings will bring you to uh, Google Now settings, it looks like. You can enable that, actually. This is how you enable it in the home screen. So yes, I'm in, and now you have this interface. It's a new interface for Google Now, a lot faster, everything is more colorful. This actually reminds me of the iPhone uh, UI for Google Now, so obviously they've updated the Android version. But if you turn to the side, now you have this. So You've got, oops, you've got the pages, and then when you turn to the right, you've got this, and right here is all your Google Now stuff, which is very cool. Uh, I like it. Uh, so, yeah, basically this is 4.4 on the Galaxy S3. Um, let's check out the camera. The camera's using a slimmer, uh, similar UI to the 4.3. I think it's actually the same. Uh, yeah, it's working fine on the back. Let's see if the front one works. So let's just switch it. No, actually it does work. Look at that. The front facing camera does work. So in this build, at least for T, uh, T999, or I747, my bad, the front facing camera does work. Oh, oh so it looks like it crashes when you uh, run it. It looks like it could be a memory leak or something like that. So I guess when you do turn on the front facing camera, it works for a little bit. Uh, <laughs> so that's the ROM, though, uh, you guys. I hope you enjoyed the video, and if you liked it, leave a five-star rating, or leave a thumbs up, and uh, rate, comment, subscribe. Uh, peace.